Okay, so Janelle and Jamie both wanted me to elaborate more on what happened with high school. Uh, mainly it was a thing of it was going great. I never really liked school that much anyways, but it was going fine until about junior year. Uh, I started just petering out. I did not want to be there. I just in general, it kind of sucked. Um, geometry, I didn't want to take it. I don't know why I didn't just drop the class rather than going every day. And instead of doing any of the work, I decided to write a book. Yeah, so didn't do so well in that class because of that. Um, and the other class that I had a problem with that year was um, history. I had marker for honors history first semester and since I am not good at taking tests whatsoever I didn't do too well in his class even though he actually surprisingly tried to help me um, and so I transferred out of his class and into uh, someone else's class for just regular history and I don't remember this gal's name but she wanted to do current events and world uh, politics I didn't want to learn that. I wanted to learn American history. So, unless it pertained to American history, I kind of butted heads with her and told her I refused to do any work unless it was history related. So, <laughs> I didn't pass that semester either. So that's where things started getting kind of bad for school. Um, it dropped my 3.5 down to a 3.0 or something like that, or close to it, and uh, went into senior year. Um, with a whole bunch of emotional stuff, mainly a thing of I decided I was tired of being boyfriendless and started pursuing this one of my guy friends and getting caught up with the uh, social aspect of school a little bit more than the actual schoolwork. Um, and senior year, I had a problem with government. I don't know why I had a problem with government. I knew the stuff. I participated in class. Um, he knew I knew the stuff, so I think he was kind of annoyed with me as well. Um, and uh, so I didn't end up passing that class either. So that's two core classes that I uh, didn't pass, which were both required to graduate. Um, so that's why I didn't graduate. My counselor said that, or asked me one time why why I wanted to graduate and I told them it was for uh, my family and my friends I didn't want to disappoint them I didn't want to be a screw up basically and he said until I could uh, do it for myself and I wanted to graduate for me it probably wasn't going to happen and uh, which is true I have actually yet to finish my courses because uh, for every once in a while it would be because I didn't have the money to get the courses um, other times it was just, I didn't feel like doing it, I didn't see the point, I was a stay-at-home mom, there was just no point. So, I, uh, still someday, hopefully, <laughs> will do it, because I don't want Nat to be disappointed in me either. But, again, that's for somebody else and not myself, and, anyways, um, the reason why I'm actually glad that it turned out the way it is is because of what happened to my mom. Um, if I had graduated, I would have almost immediately moved down to Moscow so that I could be closer to Stefan because that's where he was attending school. Um, and yeah, I had no plans after school except for working. Um, I didn't know what I wanted to do with my life. Well, it's not true. I knew I wanted to be a wife and mom. That was, in all honesty, what I wanted to do with my life. I know it seems kind of mediocre and not that great to some people, but that is what I wanted to do. Um, anyways, so I was just going to work after high school, um, but because of this I had to stay home with my parents and they sold my childhood home and we moved into a rental, so that was kind of annoying. But. Um, Mom got diagnosed with diabetes, and she took that time off, um, and then, like I said, her health declined, and uh, she found out that she had MS as well, um, or more hard to say, multiple sclerosis, um, and I became pretty much her caretaker at home, 
uh, dad could go to work and not have to worry about her being at home and I uh, stopped working myself and just stayed home with her and took her to her appointments and made sure all the meds were right and everything. Um, she regained almost all of her balance and speech back and is doing really great now. She's uh, working at Walmart, but um, while I know I should be disappointed in myself that I didn't graduate high school, mainly because I know I could. I had a good GPA. People have always told me I'm smart, whether I believe that or not. Um, I could regret that, but I don't, because I don't even want to think about what my parents would have had to have done if I wasn't there for them. Sorry. Um, anyways. So that's why I am actually very thankful that I didn't graduate with you guys. Um, it was a hard, hard year for us, um, but it was nice to have the wedding to plan because it gave us something to look forward to that wasn't, you know, all sickness and uh, things like that. Uh, excuse me. Um, and. Uh, this is kind of spastic, and I don't know if I'm explaining it right. But anyways, that was what my uh, question really was as a thing of if you could have any regrets or if there was a situation where you should have regretted it or you wish you could change it but are happy it was like that because of how other things turned out and you were able to be there or weren't able to be somewhere that it would have been bad if you were... Anyways, I'm rambling now. Um, so, I hope that kind of goes into it a little bit more. It's a little spastic, I know. Um, the other question that was asked of me was from Janelle, for all of us, for what is our TV guilty pleasure, and I don't really, I don't have TV, so I watch all my stuff secondhand. Um, and we recently got Netflix a few months ago and have it on uh, instant play. And I've been watching, uh, I started with the first season and then going through the seasons of Xena, <laughs> the warrior princess. I really don't know why, but it's been amusing me. So I guess it works. Um, let's see here. Uh, question, question. What is the one summer pastime that you used to do with your family? that you don't anymore and really, really miss. Um, for me, I used to go on vacations with my grandparents all the time, and I would spend the whole summer with them, and I loved it, I loved it. Um, and I actually really miss that, because we'd always end it with a group family camping trip. So, I, I miss those. <laughs> Anyways, I Tara, I will see you tomorrow, and everyone else will see me next week. <laughs>